Hi there. Now for this question, we're given that the binomial expansion of 1 plus kx all to the power minus 4, where the mod of kx is less than 1, is this. 1 minus 6x plus ax squared plus and so on. And we're asked to find the value of the constant k. So in order to do this, you've got to be familiar then with the binomial expansion formula. If not, do check out my video tutorials on this. So when we've got 1 plus kx all to the power minus 4, let's just write it in here, 1 plus kx all to the power minus 4, then how does this compare with what we've got here? Well, n is clearly the minus 4, and a is all of kx. So what this is going to be identical to then is the 1 plus n times a. So it's going to be plus n, which is now minus 4, and a is the kx. So just put that in. And then we've got the next term here, which is going to be plus, and we've got n, which is minus 4, and then it's multiplied by n minus 1, so we subtract 1 away from this to give us minus 5. And then this is all over factorial 2. I'm not going to write it as factorial 2. Remember, factorial 2 is 2 times 1, or just simply 2. And then we've got multiplied by a squared, so it's multiplied by all of kx, all squared. Okay, And then it's plus and so on. So let's see what we get when we tidy this up. We've got the 1, and this term then is going to be minus 4kx. And as for this term, we've got 20 divided by 2, which is 10. So we've got plus 10 times k squared x squared, so 10k squared x squared, and plus, and so on. And this compares quite nicely to what we've got here. 1 minus 6x, then, plus ax squared, and so on. And we've got to work out, then, the value of the constant k. And we can easily do this just by comparing the coefficients of x. So I'll just put here that if we compare coefficients, OK, coefficients of x, then what we've got is that minus 4k must be equal to the minus 6. So from this, it follows that k would be equal to, well, 6 over 4 if I times both sides by minus 1. So 6 over 4, and that reduces down to 1 and a half or 3 over 2. Okay?